science so much, he is really willing to risk my life and the, my brother's children's lives to celebrate it, pursuing, uh, making his 22nd appearance on this show. Wow, that is incredible. From Boston, Science Bob Flugfelder, everybody. Hey, Science Bob, Bob hey, thank nice you for coming. Back. Wow, very exciting. You know that for many years, your two biggest fans have been Wesley, I my know, nephew, and Trixie, my niece, who yeah, love yeah. your science. And the, this is about the age that you teach. You're, yeah, yeah, this is, this is my target audience right here, yeah. Your target audience. Yeah. And you're also on Cameo now, right? Uh, yes, I found I'm on Cameo. Cameo now, yeah, I can do shout outs for you, yeah. You, you can make videos for people. That's and, true, yeah. Yes, okay, well, yeah, very yeah. good. You guys know what Cameo is? No. no. Yeah, All right okay, then. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The <laughs> um, so, Science Bob, yeah. um, again, you are a real life school teacher. This is true. You've got some demos here to yes. do for us, and yeah. uh, let's do them. All right, so it, uh, the kind of nice thing is that I'm here in February, which is winter, which isn't typical. It's February, so, Bob. Feb oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah. February. Please pay attention February. to the entirety yeah. of the show. That's true, yes. <laughs> uh, so, February, uh, so uh, because of that, we have very dry air. Uh, colder air does not support as much moisture, which is why we get all this static, right? Yeah. So I figure instead of being annoyed by the static, let's embrace the static and learn from the static. That's, that's my that's motto, it. you know that. Learn from the static. You, um, yeah, you guys ever get that thing where you, uh, like you rub your feet on the carpet and then you touch something and pop, a big pop comes out? Yeah, yeah. I, did it, I did it this morning. Yeah. You did it this you morning. See? Yeah, I did it on a rug with all my friends and I, we kept shocking each other. That's great. <laughs> it's good, clean fun. Don't do drugs though, okay? <laughs> All right, so this is a try-at-home experiment. So you guys, everyone can try this at home. Uh, you need just three things. You need a good old balloon, uh, the bigger the better. You need uh, one of those, uh, you know, old grocery bags that you might have sitting under the sink. The cheaper and flimsier it is, the better it works for this. Okay. Um, and then you need either a good head of hair or maybe a wool sweater or uh, maybe a cat that uh, has got a lot of fur on it you can get some static from. Okay, get a cat. And what you're going to do is you're going to cut a ring out of the bag. This is about a centimeter, about three quarters of an inch wide. All right, you got a nice little ring there. And then we need to build up a static charge. So uh, for this, um, uh, what happens is that electrons will often leave certain materials. And we want electrons to build up on this. So when you rub a balloon in your hair, you're tearing electrons from your hair and depositing them on the balloon. Gross. So um, we're going to have uh, Guillermo right? has a 100% wool sweater. He's going to help us oh, out with this. Wow. Look at this. You. All right, so what we want you to do, do you have to go and rub the balloons on Guillermo's like Bill sweater. Bill Cosby has show, now, showed up. Really? <laughs> go ahead, rub the balloon on there. Oh. And while you're doing it, like spin it around. Try to get all sides of the balloon. All right? How does this feel, Guillermo? Good, good. Have you ever done this before? No, this I'm a, no. I can feel it. I can feel it on my yeah, hand Yeah, you can start hair. to feel that. So, all right, <laughs> excellent. All right, now hold the balloon out in front of you. Yeah. So we have negative Ooh, electrons on the balloon. just got shocked again. Uh -huh. We got negative electrons on the bag, so you can and start to see. And if all goes well, I'm going to toss this up in the air. Negative electrons repel each other. We're going to see if we can get it to float above the balloon. Okay. All right, so here we go. There's one. All right, didn't work for that you. That was great, Bob. All right, yeah, that's great. All right, we'll get it. We'll get it. All right. Go well. Okay, totally not. Wow, working. wow. Hold on, hold on. There we go. Yeah. Here we go. Okay. Ready? Okay, all right. Toss it up. Oh, uh -huh. there you go. You got to get under it, though. Wow, gotta it's like, like if it. we're... All right, this is like Ready? what we here would we do if we were trapped Wait, in an well, office max all night long. <laughs> no, slow night at the dorm. Come on. Oh, there we go. All right, hold on. I think we got this, Wes. Bob, you're fired. <laughs> it's happening. All right, hold on. No, no, we're not going to give up. Hold on. We're not giving up. Let's just see how long this will happen. go on. All right, here you go. All right, here you go. It's like floating. You got to go. Oh, there we go. Wow. There Wes, take it. Take it. There we go. Hold on. Sexy. Come on. Let's see. Bob, is everything okay at home? It's all good. It's all good, Jim. <laughs> oh, see, that was wow, right. that is amazing. It's like we're gonna try. It's, it's gonna like be a great balloon angel. That is what a, that was fantastic. Uh, Guillermo, you stay right there. All right, Guillermo. Yes, sir. thanks, Guillermo. Let's light right. some things on fire. Yeah. All right. Let's fire. Yeah. All right. I like Come on fire. Over. Thank you, Guillermo. There you go. Thanks, Guillermo. All right, uh, everyone, find a position here, and All right. uh, we're gonna have you get your gloves on and your goggles Trixie, on. Trixie, you're right over yeah, here. You go. All right, here All we right, go. All right, so here we go. Gloves and goggles. So we're Can gonna I do... put this down. Yeah, you're pretty. Thank you, okay. All right. All right, so we're gonna do a little. That was something. amazing, Bob. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. It really it works. <laughs> works. Works great most of the time. Um, 
<laughs> All right. So this Maybe is, on the next show it'll work. <laughs> this is a little zone called thermoacoustics. Okay. So uh, we're going to create a resonance wave. So Great. this happens if you're like blown in a glass bottle and you hear that tone. Or if you ever open a car window up and you get that weird oh, yeah, uh, like that, thing in yeah, your ears. I hate that. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so that's a resonance yeah. wave. Okay. So uh, here's what we've got. We've got just uh, some steel tubes. Mm -hmm. And then in the tube, about a little of the ways up, I got just some screen. Oh, I see. All right? I see. Okay. Yeah, so this is just like steel screening. Yeah, all right. <laughs> uh, you're not impressed. I'm yet. having inappropriate thoughts right okay, now. Okay, well, yeah. let's not do that. Yeah. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to uh, take up some blow torches. We're going to heat up that screen. That's good, right? Okay. That's Reese gonna, Witherspoon uh, didn't let you use a blowtorch, did she? <laughs> Torch um, once that's heated, uh -huh. all right, then we're going to turn these off, put them back on the table. Okay. And then one at a time, you guys are going to turn these vertical. All that's right. That's going to create a current of oh. air from the well, heat. Well, we'll see. Well, hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> all right. And uh, if all goes well, uh -huh. um, it'll create a little bit of a tone. Okay. All right. So all fire right. them up, guys. All right. Do the kids know how to do this? Okay. There we go. And then what? All right. So put it in. We're going to heat up that screen. So there you go. Going to do this for about seven seconds or so. Yeah. A little more, move it around a little, really heat it up. All right, it's that's melting. good. So now you can turn them off. Okay. Let's go back on the table. Okay. All right, Wesley, lift yours up vertically. Other way, other way. All right, Jimmy, lift yours up vertically. Whoa. God. All right, Trixie, lift yours up vertically. Close encounters of the third kind. Yeah. Now that's pretty that cool. Is... And what do you have over here, Bob? All right, so we figured let's do this a little bit bigger, huh? Is that okay? Yeah, let's do it a little bit bigger. Yeah. All right, so Jimmy, come on over here. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna have you come over here. You're gonna hold this. Who, me? Yeah, yeah. All right. So we're gonna have you hold this uh, horizontally. Okay. All right. And then at one point, uh, you're gonna kind of, you might have to move your hands over here. All right, here kids, climb in. All right. Uh, Wesley, you okay with flamethrowers? Yeah. All right, good. excellent. So we're going to turn this baby on. Whoa! Right, there we go. Totally and uh, you squeeze that. That's yeah, going to yeah. get it. We have a piece of screen in there. Go ahead and heat that one up. Okay. Oh, yeah. Trixie, you're not allowed to use a flamethrower until you're 13. Next time, we'll get you in on the flamethrower. All right, back a little bit further. There we go. Oh, that's starting to glow nice and orange. Looks like we found the tunnel to hell. All right, you're good. I'll take that. All right, Jimmy, very carefully tip it vertically. Uh-huh. And there we go. Oh. That's right. That's pretty cool. Yeah. We'll be right back. You what? can smell it. You can smell it? Yeah, you can smell it. We're what are we going to do when we come back, Bob? Uh, so when we come back, we're going to do a, a detonation wave experiment. Oh, detonation when we come back. We'll be right back with Science Bob. We're back with the one and only Science Bob Flugfelder, the kids. This is too dangerous for the kids to be on stage. Correct, And yeah. yet it's fine for me to be here. Yeah, the crew didn't have any issue with that. Yeah, that's uh, weird. Yeah, yeah okay. so we are, that's because we were actually dealing with pretty high-level explosives for this one. Really? Yeah, we are. So in modern mining, uh, you know, in the Old West... They I get that use, magazine. I love it. <laughs> Uh, in the old West, they would use like a fuse, you know, like in uh, uh, the Bugs Bunny cartoons. Right. Uh, but now they actually use something called shock tubing to instigate an explosion. And shock tubing in itself is an amazing science demonstration. So this is shock tubing. Okay. And uh, there is a very highly uh, explosive powder inside of this. In fact, it's often more explosive than the explosive it's triggering. That seems bad. That would seem bad. However, it's enclosed in here. I'm pretty sure that it has the integrity to stay in there. Um, and what's interesting about this is it doesn't actually need a flame to start the way a normal that flame That also would. seems bad. No, 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 it uses a pressure wave. And so this is a supersonic pressure wave that actually travels through here at about uh, 4,700 miles an hour. I don't believe it. Yeah, it's true, and we're gonna see it. Um, so here's what we've got. The whole demonstration should last a total of about 0.2 seconds. Okay, all right. All right? But the good news is uh, tonight we have a high-speed camera. So this is going to be a demonstration where it really reveals itself even after the demonstration, and we look at it in slow-mo. I love this idea. All Let's right. do it. All right, so uh, here's what we're going to do. We figured we'd get you involved with this. Mm -hmm. So we're going to put this. This, by the way, is... Put uh, it on my head? Uh, yeah, just hold that you know, around chest level. Okay. And you'll get to see it close up traveling through here. Oh, great. Um, this is about um, um, a little more uh, explosive than TNT. For real? Yeah, for real. <laughs> 
Okay. I think why, we're ready. Why do I have a like a habit trail then? And uh... <laughs> well, it's, you know, it keeps it all enclosed. Oh, by the way, then we have a big finale here. We've got a hydrogen balloon at the end. Oh, uh, good, so that's more a balloons. Very flammable gas. Yeah. Okay. Uh, audience, if you don't like loud sounds, you might want to put your uh, fingers in your ears to protect you. Mm -hmm. You're okay. Yeah, I'm all fine. Right, I guess. Excellent. All right. I don't know. And here we go. I guess we'll find out in 0.2 seconds if I'm okay. All right, here we go. All right, we're gonna fire this. Okay. Detonation wave, removing the safety. Firing in three, two, one. All right. That was pretty cool. Oh. I thought I this know. was gonna explode. Oh, no, 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 it's all in there. Oh. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do uh, three replays. Why did here. I hold this then? Oh, you'll see, you'll see, oh. trust us. All right, so we're gonna do three replays. Okay. First one we're gonna see in real time. Just all right, remind let's look. us what we just saw. And, all right, so again, point two seconds. Yeah. You didn't even know what was going on. Right, right? as so, usual. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, now we're gonna, here, I can take this for you. All right, uh, thank so you. Now let's look at it in what we call like broadcast slow-mo. Right? Okay. So that's, uh, I think, about 160 frames per okay, second. Okay, this would right. be like, uh, like Fox Sports yeah. 1995. Right, exactly. Okay. All right, All right, so we got to see that detonation wave travel a little uh, bit more. We did see that, All right. okay. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna watch it at um, 8,300 frames per second. Okay. All right, so All right. let's take a look, and I think right. it's gonna look a little bit different. There's Whoa. Guillermo. This all happened? This all happened Come on in now. two seconds. Did it really? I don't believe it. Isn't COVID isn't real either, is it? <laughs> this was Look, all that's happening. You. That was you. This is like a superhero movie. And then movie. this crazy spaghetti looking thing just flying through Did you through just that. say the F word? No, I did oh. not. Okay, oh, I thought all you right, did. All right, so now we're getting close uh -huh. to when it's gonna be, uh, hopefully, like lighting up your face. All right, well, wait, watch this there. Well, this hey, all there. happened. The show and explosion, Come there on. you are. That is wow. unbelievable. Isn't that amazing? That was right. me. And now watch, now look. look, first you think, oh, we don't get it's to see over. the hydrogen balloon, but wait. All right, here it comes. This is what we call a deflagration wave. So this is the explosion of the hydrogen, all right? And there it is. So that's the ex uh, hydrogen balloon exploding. Wow, yeah. wow. Well, that was, um, that was mildly it. interesting. Wow. Yeah, no, yeah. That's very cool. Thank you, Science Bob. Science Bob is on Cameo, guys. Wesley Kimmel, Trixie Kimmel, Guillermo Rodriguez. Thank you. If you want to try, try these experiments at home, go to sciencebob.com. Thanks to Reese Witherspoon. Apologies to Matt Damon. Nightline is next. Thanks for watching, everybody. Good night. Good night.